come up with your own hot take. And don't do it in a vacuum. Like, try it on people. Make people angry, make people love you. Or do it in a vacuum. If that's what you feel like is expressing your inner opinion, that's what you need to harness. Hey folks, I am Andre Shannon. And I'm Jack Jen Atherton. We're both graduates of the BA from Afters. We have our own segment at FBI 94.5 Radio called Movies, Movies, Movies that we do on Monday mornings where we do film reviews and talk about film culture. We also have a podcast called Cinema Girls, which we make with the wickedly talented Lily Bennett, who's also a graduate, and Maria Dimitrakis, who currently goes to Afters and does radio. We've had our own work shown at film festivals around the world, including Slam Dance at Seattle International Film Festival. And you can catch all of our own films and work, which is all kind of a supernatural gay porn at Australian Reflex with 3 xscom more importantly, here are our top three tips on how to be the, the hottest, hottest film, film critic, critic in, in town. town. Taste, knowledge, ideas, TKI. Surround yourself with taste and knowledge and ideas. Watch a bunch of movies, read as much as you can. Have as many conversations as you can. I take that back. You won't even have to, f don't feel obliged to watch only movies though. If you feel like you're gonna contribute the best by consuming music and podcasts and different types of food. You need to just do that. You need to consume what's going to fuel your ideas about movie watching and surround yourself with great individuals and great voices that you can reek from. Especially when you have time to watch whatever you want rather than having to watch things on a schedule. Mm. Your first priority should be watching as much as you can and thinking about them in your own way as opposed to watching everything you want and then just copying everyone else. Feel free to pick your own medium. Film criticism writing is so dead, it still exists, but it's not that happening anymore. And if you feel that you're best expressing yourself through broadcast ways, like podcasts or video essays, or even talking to the camera like we're doing right now, that is legit film criticism. And you need to pick your medium right at the start and just feel confident with, ah! with it as much as you want. Especially like the most legitimate form of film criticism is probably meme culture. Mm. Just like make a meme. That's true actually, yeah. Whether it's meme culture, video essays, podcasting, responding to a or film Or just make your through. own film, like Kelly Reichardt made River mm. of Brass because she was so over Thelma and Louise and she wanted a different ending. Yeah, make an art film, make an art piece, do a dance, any platform, any medium you like, you should just go for it. Make, make film, film criticism, criticism your, your own art, art form. form. You need to treat it like it's an expressionistic baby that you're giving birth to, not just some job that you have to sit down and pump out for everyone else to read. Based okay. on wanting to show things through a different lens and make people have a different conversation about it, you don't want to just sum up the basic plot points and give people a way to think about the film mm. that is obvious or basic. Just look at it this way. You're given an opportunity to present an idea and you need to find the most cunning and exciting and beautiful and imaginative way of delivering that idea. And don't feel that you need to play up to a bunch of catchphrases and keywords that people are doling out about the film because you're not an advertiser. No, you're not. Have a hot take. Hot takes are great. Have a sexy point of view. That's what people want. No one wants to just read the same shit over and over again. That's what The Guardian's for. And people want to be excited about going to the films. Everyone loves going to the films. That's what we figured out was that people love going to movies and like mm. people just want to talk about them. So it's actually not as hard as you think to have if, an opinion. If at the end of the day, your film criticism encourages people to watch movies, then that's a job well done. If you like these hot tips, you can catch our original video of top tips on how to do genius installation art. Or catch Marie Dimitrakis, our producer on Cinema Girls. Uh, she talks about radio presenting 101s. All these are available in the Afters YouTube channel. Yeah.